Hi guys. Okay, so I'm gonna wash my brushes today and I'm gonna be using this little silicone, um, the silicone container. I got this at Macy's backstage a few months ago back in the summer and I thought I'd try it. And as you can see here, um, it has these um, grooves in it of different sizes and shapes. And what that's supposed to do is, I guess, when you rub it, rub the brush over it, it, you know, gets in between the bristles and gets all the product out. And it works really good using this. It has cut my um, my washing time like by seventy five percent because I was basically using my hands before. I would just put the the um, the detergent in my hand and just rub the brush. But this works really, really good. Okay, so these are my brushes um, that I'm going to be washing um, today. And I'm going to use this. I got it in my, um, my, oh my gosh, I can't remember what the name <laughs> Oh my God, the Boxy Charm. Yeah, the December Boxy Charm. And it is supposed to be a brush cleaner and conditioner. So, um, previously I would just use, uh, Dawn, um, to wash my brushes, which works really, really well, but I wanted to try this to see how well it works. All right. So I'm just going to add, um, a little bit of warm water. Well, first I should probably put the, the product in and just see. I don't even know how much to use because I've never used this before. And I don't really know, um, you know, the consistency, how thick it is, and what it does. So, I'm just go ahead and just add some in there. That looks like it should be enough. Okay, so I'm just gonna add a little bit of water. Oops, I knocked some things over there. Okay, so this brush right here, okay, this um, brush has the most product on it and it is an emollient base product, so basically a creamy product. And in the past, this one right here would take the longest to wash, but since I've gotten this little container, it's you know it gets clean like really quick so now i want to um go ahead and try this one first so we're just gonna rub it in and the thing is with this it does not um actually um mess with the shape of the brush the silicone container so let's see all right um this has a kind of a what do you call it the smell is sort of minty it has some kind of mint scent to it so if it gets this one clean then the rest i know will be no problem because this one is the one that usually um, takes the longest. Well, not necessarily takes the longest, but this one is the one that is, um, you know, has the most stubborn uh, product because it's emollient based. So, yeah. So, uh, I love this this little um, dish because trust me, it does in fact cut your shampooing time down by like i said 75 percent and it wasn't that expensive i think i paid like four dollars and some cents for it so see so most of it's already gone Okay, so I want to come back and show you that 
this is the brush um, so for me it's clean enough so I'm gonna go ahead and do the others which will be much easier um, this was a little bit sudsy which is okay um, I don't really like too much suds um, because it takes a long time to get out of the hair bundle when you're washing so the less suds the better as long as the brush gets clean um, and that's the most important thing so I'm just gonna go ahead and do the others um, and then I'll come back to show you the results and give you my thoughts on this product the dish I washed it I used um, what am I saying here's the dish so after I used it to wash my brushes and get all the product out the dish I just wanted to show you that it does not get stained with any of the uh, the products um, the residue from the brushes and I'm about to they still got the um, the product in them I just I haven't washed them out yet but I just wanted to let you see how this dish um, doesn't get stained so I'm about to wash my brushes out now do is when I wash them I just squeeze the excess water out to see if there's any um, soapy residue or anything and then there's none so that way I know that these brushes are ready to lay down and I always just try to just get this area wet and not the whole brush because it can loosen the, uh, the glue that holds the hair bundle into the ferrule and that could destroy your brush. Okay, so these are my brushes. I've laid them out to dry and I have them on a a uh, dish drying mat that I got from the Dollar Tree for a dollar. It works really well. And one thing I would say about the product that I used to um, to wash these is this. Um, the scent that I was picking up was actually um, lavender. It's like a light lavender scent. And it does not, even though it cleans... The brush it is brushes it does not have like excessive uh excessive uh, sudsing so that means that when you wash your brushes like all of the detergent and everything along with the product comes out quickly so you don't have to you know be um excessively shamp washing washing to get the 
the detergent out, which is great. Um, so yeah, so I really like this. Um, the price of it, I will leave that in um in a comment or the description to let you know if you're interested in in it. Um, will I purchase this again? I mean, I use my Dawn, which is fine, which works perfectly fine. Um, but it just depends on the price, you know. And it has, I mean, it's like 2.5 ounces. Uh, I didn't really have to use that much to the, to get the brushes clean. So just depends, depending on the price. That's how you know if it's worth it. If you're someone who's washing brushes like a lot and this is all, this is the only size you got and it's like expensive, I don't think that makes sense. But if it's, you know, you're not, these are my personal brushes that I use. And I wash them once a week, depending on how frequently I use them during the week. That would be fine for me. So that's my review on the Aesthetica Pro Series Brush Cleaner and Conditioner. And my bristles do feel, they do be, feel soft, but they feel soft anyway, even when I use the Dawn. So, you know, yeah. All right, so thank you so much for watching. And let me know what you think in the uh, comments. You know, just hit me up, give me a comment, let me know what you think. Let me know if you have tried this product, if you've used it, used it before, if you're currently using it, and if you like it. Bye! Thank you so much for watching.